Hey guys, what is up? x this here and welcome back to another video. I'm playing demo today and I'll just jump straight into my build going with my talents. Here are my talents, going with the build that I actually, you know, made a video on. So if you haven't seen that, then go check it out. Absolutely awesome. Um, so that's my obviously demo build and then I've gone with Vision Perfection, Condensed Life Force, Lucid Dreams, Conflict and Strife and then gone with the Supreme Commander build of Baleful Invocation. But I kind of want to start this video off, not on a depressing note, but on a serious topic because I haven't really talked about serious topics in quite a while. And I just want to basically, for those people who's going through something in life, whether it be depression or whether it be anxiety or something on those lines, I just want to basically shout out to you guys and try and spread some positivity because at the end of the day I find like... People don't really talk about that kind of stuff anymore and it's good to get the awareness out. So this video is basically for you. Like if anyone's ever said to you in life like you can't do anything, you're never going to amount to nothing or anything and you're just never, never like going to be capable of doing great things in life then you know what I say to that? Screw them man because at the end of the day you're your own person and only you know what you're capable of. Like if people's going to shut you down. That's literally what all people do. They come and they hate on you. They always talk, you know, absolute rubbish and they try and put you down. But hey, at the end of the day, I know that you're capable. And if anyone's told you that you're not, then be inspired to prove them otherwise, you know. Like, I didn't think I'd be able to hit um, 1k subs on YouTube. I didn't think I was going to make it at all doing something I love. And although I haven't got that many subscribers, I still feel like I'm... Um, getting you know like a really solid bond with everybody on the channel and I, I just feel like that much better for posting content because it allows me to express myself and just show you guys that anything's possible like like I said I'm not the biggest youtuber I'm not the biggest wow youtuber nothing like that right but at the end of the day I have fun making the content I enjoy and although people are going to hate on you and basically say you know x-ray this you should be doing these videos these are going to get you the most views these are going to make you the most money blah 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 right no I just post what I enjoy I don't care if I don't get any money from YouTube right at the end of the day I'm doing this for absolute fun if money was the key to like success I, I definitely don't have it then because like I, I barely make anything right and at the end of the day it's not about money at all it's about doing what you love and I absolutely love creating content and that's what I just aspire to be if I can get to a goal where I can reach loads of subs and you know just express my views via um, you know content like this then I think I've made it in life right but hey None of this depressing nonsense at the beginning of the video, but I just want to say if you're using WoW or video games as like a platform to escape from reality, then if you're watching this right now, then this video is for you and I just want to say that you're capable of what they say you're not and I believe in you, man. But hey, we're playing demo and despite me talking about a depressing subject, right, we managed to get some nice killing blows at the beginning. I actually think demo could be a force to be reckoned with in PvP. I think is very very solid right now. I think Affliction may be the worst in PvP. Deathstroke's obviously going to still be the best, but the five percent damage increase is so nice. All right, you ready? This is how you win against Rogue. Come on, open up on me, man. Okay, he's he's not going to open up on me. This is a big mistake for him. All right, I'm going to show you what I like doing. Right. So pop the backdraft, gonna get my um, nice burst out here. He's gonna kick me, which is okay. Oh, I don't have my, ah, okay, I don't have my bind. It's okay, guys. I'm fine with this. I'm absolutely fine with this. Gonna pre-wall, send my pets on him. No, don't help, man. I just wanna show them for the video what Demo can do in a 1v1. Nice. He kicked me, but he didn't really kick any important spells. Gonna stun him here, and he is dead. I didn't even use any cooldowns either. I still feel tanky without demon armor. I know it's a strange concept, but demon armor did get a nerf at the end of the day, and I don't think, you know, Destro and Affliction's gonna be like that much better than Demo now. I actually think Demo is probably gonna be one of the best Warlock specs in the sense that it has such great 
maneuverability and oh my god that's a lot of people has you know so much utility to work with i say that all the time stuns are immaculate um just anything in general it's just so good man Got it. sorry i'm getting used to my key binds on this um as this spec and it's kind of hard right now hand the goal down look at his look at his hp man Pfft. i'm telling you if you can get free cast off, Demo's going to be one of those specs that are just going to crush melee, in my opinion. Like, sure, if you have people sitting on you, it's going to be very, very hard to actually get away and escape. But I feel like if you can tank the damage and just go with solid burst damage, you're going to be doing that much better in BGs. Like, of course, I am not the best, you know, player at all, like... But by far, there's so many people just that much better than me in PvP, and obviously... We, we all know that, right? I don't play because um, I want to push rating. I play for fun. But I'm telling you, as a inexperienced player, technically, I mean, I've been playing this game for a long time, but as a person who doesn't play demo anymore, I can definitely say for a fact that demo is going to be one of those specs you need to watch out for, especially with these corruption gear and everything. You can, If you can get, like, Twilight Devastation, if you can get anything that improves your damage, easy peasy, a lemon... Squeezy. Hello there. I was going to reflect that too because I had a feeling you were coming. Oh my god. I actually do have better gear. So as you saw in... Oh, hello. As you saw in the video, I am 461 item level. I actually have better gear in my bag. 465. I have 480s. 480 chests as well. But I just don't want to use it because that... I, you know, at the end of the day, I have to start fixing everything. And it's just a nightmare. I have to sort out all my traits again, and the costs are going to be a nightmare to, like, sort out. Fear this guy. Right, now we kill the healers. Oh, there we go. We got a tyrant. I swear we just got a tyrant proc, didn't we? I actually might be inclined to go demo, guys. Like, I'm not even kidding. I actually might change the demo. This, this really does feel so much better than Affliction. Now, obviously... It's going to be better than a dot spec, right? Because dot specs are just not in at the moment. But, dude, I'm telling you. This is absolutely awesome. Right, I'm going to reflect here. Pop my damage into full fear. Cloak this off. Keep my distance. End with my implosion. He's dead. 100% dead here. Oh, he's got a rage regen. Yeah, he's still dead. Wow. I, d I just feel like with the nerfs to... I know we got like a nerf to uh, Demon Armor and like I think Soul Leech did that get a passive nerf? I can't remember now off the top of my head. But I just feel like with those nerfs, it actually makes Demo stronger in the sense that you don't have to be a force um, to survive like with Demon Armor. Because obviously as Demo, you don't have Demon Armor. Right, you don't have Dark Soul. You have nothing like that, but you have the most insane... Oh my god, I just stunned him. No, he just got stunned on his uh, Goblin Glider. And he just gets stunned again. And um, yeah, but like I was saying, like, you don't have that burst potential with Demon Armor. But you have all of the CC, which allows your demons just to absolute shred. The comp I want to play in 3s is with a Beastmaster Hunter or a DK, like... I actually think that could be very nice with demo locks because the sheer pressure you get off from your pets is just ridiculous. Now, obviously, I can't speak for experience, but I have played a lot of... I think it's called Shadow Cleave, right, with Unholy DK and a Warlock, right? But I'm just saying, like, that was one of my favourite compositions, especially in Miss Pandaria as well. And obviously, in, like, Legion and stuff, it was really, really solid. All right. What we're going to do is try and end this game on a win, obviously. It looks like a flawless win, and obviously we talked about personal topics today because I feel like people don't address those issues, and they need to be addressed. Like, I know it's a sensitive topic to talk about, but at the end of the day, if you're not talking about it, then nobody's going to get the help they need. So if we can clean sweep the horde and end on a good note, I'm telling you, today's a great day, man. Right, I need to be utilising my kick a lot more. I can get out of this route, but I'm not going to waste it because nobody's f focused on me, you know? Hello there. 
Right, looks like we're gonna actually cap. Look how many demons I have out. Dude, I got 10 imps just chilling. Oh, hello. I'm gonna play towards my team. Hey, there's. I swear there's another rogue here somewhere. Yeah, I got sapped. I'm actually gonna dismount. I'm gonna trinket this. Into full fear. I baited his kick. Alright, here we go. Big, big damage now. He's running. He's running. He knows he messed up. That's why. I stunned him. He's dead. Oh, no. We're dead. Damn it, guys. I can't believe that. I can't believe we just died there. I had soul stone. Um, didn't have reflect up, though. Yeah, I had soul stone and I could have drained life, but that was like five on me at the end there. So I couldn't do anything. Damn, it would have been like the best clean sweep ever, but it's okay. All right, going to stay from the back lines. I always say this in like most of my videos. You just want to, like, especially as demo, because obviously you can't survive. So you, you just want to be chilling, you know? This guy does zero damage to me. I think I'm dead here again. Dude, this sucks. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh! No! He shadow stepped me! Are you kidding? Wow. Okay, guys. Well, unfortunately, we died twice in today's episode. But that was just so unfortunate. I could have got away. I didn't realize we were that close to capping. I should have just glided out immediately and we would have survived. But hey, that's the, like... Demo mentality, you just want to push that damage out. But hey, right, so, killing blows, second on killing blows, damage-wise, we were okay on damage, like, what, fourth on our team? So it's not bad, but hey, we died two times, and we got eight killing blows, not too bad. I would say that this has been a eventful video. Obviously, I want to start pushing more wild content out to you guys, but at the moment, kind of unlike a roller coaster in the sense that I'm just sitting on that roller coaster and, you know, wherever it takes me, I'm going to follow it. Because at the end of the day, I really like experimenting with different type of videos. And although WoW's a main game, I kind of like branching off to other games just so we can obviously get a wider audience and just play stuff we enjoy. Like, obviously, I enjoy WoW. I'm going to be posting a ton more. So you'll probably see another WoW video very soon after this one. But I just want to say that, like, thank you for watching this video. Obviously, there's topics that people don't want to talk about and i just want to say if people have ever shut you down in life and told you, you can't do something then screw that man do the opposite and make something with your life just don't think about what the haters have to say at the end of the day like i believe in you i'm sure everybody else believes in you just don't sit in that dark place and actually you know do something if you want to make videos on youtube do it if you want to stream do it man like you're the only one holding yourself back Sounds bad, but it's true. At the end of the day, right, everyone believes on you, and I'm, I'm counting on you as well, man. But yeah, thank you for watching today's video. Demo seems to be very solid at the moment. I actually think it's very good. Obviously, I have to experiment more. Like, my action bars is just a complete mess at the moment. There's just so much going on. But all the haters that said this spec doesn't work, I'm telling you it does. And I don't even have all my best gear equipped at the moment, like... I'm using this 450 trinket. I have a better trinket in my bag, but I just wanted the versatility just so I can survive a little bit extra. I have 480 Azerite pieces, which I'm not using. I'm telling you, if I, f like, focused, I probably could do it. But, yeah, sorry, I'm dragging this um, outro out. Um, so, I just want to say thank you for watching today's video. If you did like it, obviously, leave a like, comment down below, and also subscribe to the channel. I'll be excited. Catch you next one. So, peace!